Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. A typical answer is e5, which builds a position in the middle, controls d4, and frees up the queen and bishop on the dark square. The king's gambit is a forceful opening that begins with f4. White weakens their king side to swiftly assault the e5 pawn and can develop with nf3. x4 captures the gambit pawn and opens up the center. bc4 develops the bishop to an active diagonal where it attacks the f7 square and controls d5. d5 gains space in the center, attacks the bishop and allows the light squared bishop to develop. It is the last book move. This passes up a chance to seize a helpless pawn. It falls flat. This develops a queen off its starting square, getting it into the action. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This steps away from the checking queen. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This misses an opportunity to develop a bishop off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy.